What's up fam? This your boy Cut to the Chase TV. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and be sure to share this video. I got some news for you niggas today. Wack 100 is still the most hated man in hip hop after Hassan Campbell leaked a private conversation in which Wack 100 alleged that he has a zesty tape of Nipsey Hussle involving another man and he's the only reason the tape hasn't been released to the public. Now once the news hit the internet, all hell broke loose. Everybody's mad at WAC 100. Everybody's condemning them. Everybody calling him a snake, a backstabber, and many people seem to think that he's just hating on the late great Nipsey Hussle. But WAC 100 stood 10 toes down. He said, y'all need to be thanking me that the tape hasn't been released. So now you gotta divide amongst people. You got one group of people that believes WAC 100, that thinks there's a Nipsey Hussle zesty tape involving another man. And then you got the other group of people that's saying, WAC 100 is a snake. He's just trying to tarnish the reputation of Nipsey Hussle. If there is a tape, then prove it. And amongst that group is Nipsey Hussle old gang, the Rolling 60s. They confronted WAC on Clubhouse. They said, I've been knowing Nipsey my whole life. Nipsey don't get down like that. If you got a tape of him, release it now. And then things went left. And pay attention to WAC 100 response involving all this. Let's take a listen to it. Why is the homie name always in your mouth, bro? Hey, man, stay in your place, man. I am in my place. That's my homie. He's 6'0". Six -so. I'm 6'0". -so. Okay. You know, that's that's, that's 6'0". So if six -so. you know, then you know. I don't know. That's why I, I know you don't know. know. That's that's you know. Know. Man, I've been game banging with him my whole life. Nigga, Wait a minute. Y'all hear that? He says that like that's a badge of honor. I've been game banging with Nip my whole life. Like that's his lifetime achievement award. Why do they always gotta bring that up when you first meet him? Have you ever been around a game banger? Hey, my name cut to the chase. TV, how you doing? Man, I've been game banging for six years. That's what they lead the conversation with. Don't give you a name. Don't ask how you doing. They wanna tell you about their life of crime and the gang activities they're involved in. But let's continue. I'm 34 years old, bro. Yo, Yo, what you on, bro? Uh, that, everything you saying? Is allegations, bro. Where okay, is how much proof? money you got? Where's the proof? How much money you got? Man, man I was worried about money, bro. You yeah, got more yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's whack. Come on, no, bro, I gotta whack. pay the nigga. Look, check it out, check it out. You got, you got more money than me, whack. No, that ain't what you we got, talking about. Check, you I gotta pay, pay the nigga. Ain't got nothing to do with me. You, look, you I'm, a, I'm gonna make the nigga. Hey, listen, you, just you know this. All right. Basically, whack 100 is saying, you want me to provide the proof of the tape? will give me the money so I can pay him so the guy can release it. Wack 100 is saying the guy's not gonna release the tape unless he get paid for it. So this is basically extortion. I won't release the tape if you guys pay me this much money or I will release the tape only if I get this much money for it. But let's continue. Didn't mean, no, we ain't talking that. about that. Then why are you asking me that question? Cause it ain't bro, I got, we gotta pay the nigga, right? Mm, got, who you gotta, gotta pay, pay who? What you mean? You expect him to just come deliver something for free? You oh don't believe that. God, this cat. But what you said, you said we got the tape. We got it. You said we. I mean, well, I've been the only nigga keeping me from putting that shit out. Mm, man, come on, Wack. Come on, bro. Hey, hey, hey. I'm going to put it like this. Hey, listen. Hey, where, I'm going to put it like this, this though, bro. I'm going to put it like this. Listen, I'm going to leave it like this. Hold on, I'm going to put it like this. Have the baby mama denied anything? She not even talking to you. I know she ain't gonna deny. Ain't you know why she ain't gonna? Wait a minute. That's a good point by WAC 100. Everybody's saying it's a tape involving Nipsey Hussle, a man and his baby mama. Everybody's saying it was some zesty stuff involved on that tape. Why hasn't his baby mama came and spoke out about it? If it's not true, all she gotta do is release a statement, go on Instagram Live and say they don't have any tape involving me, Nipsey, and another man. But she just kept quiet. She's not even addressing the rumors, so it makes me think that it might be some truth to that tape. I don't know. Let's continue. Oh, the night, bro. What I'm gonna do though. All right, look, all right. Hey, no, no, answer this question. No, I'm going to get out. Hey, listen. Answer this question. I'm going to get out right here. We need answers. We need answers. Don't go to Holland. Well, no, nigga. I'm going to get out of the way. I'm standing on what I said. I'm going to let that man do what he want to do. Nigga, what did you talk about? I'm going to make sure it come out now. Nigga, make it. Wait, y'all hear that? Wack is saying he's going to make sure the tape comes out. So he basically releasing the Nipsey Hustle Zesty tape. Wack 100 saying since y'all coming at me, 
I've been keeping the tape a secret, but since y'all guys want to come at me, y'all want to threaten me, y'all want to call me names, y'all want to call me the snake, I'm done looking out for Nipsey Hussle, so I'm going to make sure the tape comes out. Man, let's continue, though. Make it come out, nigga. Yeah, okay, all right. It's going to yeah, come out, believe that. But what? That's going to make you look No, 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 no. No, no. Let him do it. Niggas don't respect the fact that I'm keeping it from coming out. Nah, I'm going to get out the way. Fuck you. Fuck you. Nobody doing business. I'm going to get right on it. I'm going to get right on it. You need to creep. I'm going to get right on it, buddy. You spoke about it, so you might as well go on and put it out. Pussy. Let me say this to Nipsey Hustle homeboys. Be careful what you guys ask for. Because you guys are confronting Whack 100 on Clubhouse. If you got the tape, release it. I don't think it's true. You cap and release the tape, then release the tape. Then the moment that tape comes out, you're going to be crying. You're going to be blaming Whack 100 saying, see, man, you trying to extort Nipsey Hustle. You put the tape out. But you guys are coming at him saying, prove that he has the tape. And Whack 100 saying, he been keeping the tape a secret. He don't want it to remain out in the public. Then you guys should just say, keep it that way. We'll talk behind the scenes, but all this on Clubhouse forcing the man hand. And then when he make his move, everybody's going to be upset about it. So like I said, be careful what you ask for. And this is just go going, getting out of control. Wack 100 and Big U is going at it. And now Wack 100 and Big U niece is even going back and forth. They've been going back and forth on Clubhouse the last few days. And now Wack 100 is now threatening Big U niece. Let me read you these text messages. Let's go. In the first text message, Wack 100 say, I warned you to stay out my stuff. You want to feel important. You ain't in this. Stop getting at me about business that don't concern you. But since you want to play, we can play. So that's the first message Wack sent Big U niece. Let's read another one. What the F you calling about? Coming in into trends, asking me questions. I'm giving no ducks right now. I'm warning your butt right now. So Wack 100 is giving her a stern warning. He's saying, I'm not about that life. You keep trying to come at me, I'm going to violate you. And I want to say this. Everybody need to relax. Everybody need to calm down before this get out of control. Because once you start threatening people, you can't take that back. Once you start threatening the niece of Big U, you know Big U is a heavy hitter in the rolling 60s. He got clout. Whack 100. You might be putting your foot in your mouth. I know you ain't scared. I know you ain't no punk. But don't let this internet stuff get your head knocked off. Don't let the people on Clubhouse rile you up to get you in a situation that you can't deal with. Because once you get off the internet, you still got to deal in the real world. You still got to maneuver in the streets of Cali. And you don't want to put a target on your back by this and this. Hustle, Big U, and his niece. So hopefully you guys can talk on behind the scenes. I know you guys got a good relationship with each other. Try to get this cleared up. You might want to reach out to Big U as well. Let's try to get this figured out. Don't let a New Yorker like Hassan Campbell cause a rift on the West Coast. Those are my advice to everybody involved. But anyway, guys, this is your boy Cut to the Chase TV. Those are my thoughts on Wack 100 threatening Big U niece and releasing the zesty tape of Nipsey Hustle. But I want to know what you guys think. Leave a comment. Share this video. I love you guys. Peace.